Hello, I'm Magda from I'm a Little Creature. Recently I've made Lightning McQueen from Cars. I was inspired of uh, some photos, pictures of uh, that car and uh, I had to work out uh, the parts, how to crochet them and join them uh, together. You see? It was quite difficult, uh, but I'm uh, really happy with the result. Free pattern of uh, this car is uh, available in my blog. Um, I took lots of photos uh, during uh, working on that project. Uh, um, so uh, in the blog you may um, look at these uh, photos. Um, I try to explain you um, the particular steps uh, um, the best I could, so I hope uh, everything is uh, explained um, properly. Uh, what about the final size? Um, it's uh, 45 centimeters long and 20 centimeters as for the materials, uh, the mostly I used the Himalaya Dolphin Baby Red number 318, three skins, black number 311, one skin, dark grey and number 320 two skins and for this windshield white number 301 one skin and for the smile for Himalaya Dolphin Baby I worked with a 4 mm crochet hook and I prefer the size 4 mm for Himalaya Dolphin Baby as you remember, I made Thomas the Train um, crochet with 4.5 mm crochet hook. I thought uh, that uh, it's a, a better uh, crochet hook that time when I crochet it. But then I used 4 mm crochet hook for the Thomas and um, I recommend you to use the smaller hook, 4 mm. In my blog, you will find the update for the Thomas, I correct some mistakes, for example, rows not rounds in semicircle parts, and I used a piece of thick felt for the bottom of the train and for the wheels. Final size of the Thomas uh, with a 4 mm crochet hook is 45 cm long and 40 cm tall with a chimney, and without the chimney, about 30 centimeters tall. So I recommend you to try my pattern for the Thomas. Um, and now let's talk about uh, um, Lightning McQueen. I told you about Himalaya Dolphin Baby. Now um, I used uh, yarn art jeans, black and blue for the eyes white for the lights uh, for this uh, small lightning gray and and the black for uh, the edging you see this is black yarn art jeans sometimes I split the yarn art jeans uh, uh, because yarn art jeans you see it consists of four plies and um, for this edging I used two plies I crocheted a single crochet around it's quite simple split it like this but you need to cut a longer um, yarn or I used one one um, thread for example for these numbers you need to adjust it to your uh, to your needs I also used uh, this 
yellow orange red yarn this is let's look at this merino gold batik madame tricot Paris. color eight three five i like it because it has lots of uh, tones and i need to choose uh, at the beginning of the yarn sometimes uh, so you need to you see uh, little balls because i had to um adjust it for example start from the yellow then orange uh, red and from this letter also yellow orange red i need to uh, add it some uh, yarns to adjust it to my numbers and this lightning and for this lettering rusties i used felting wool yellow and a needle felted this lettering firstly i sketched this uh, with the yarn and then needle felted and as for a crochet hook i told you that for himalaya dolphin baby i used four millimeter crochet hook uh, for yarn art jeans i used a two millimeter crochet hook and uh, mm, but for this uh, uh, lettering on the roof i wanted to make it a bit bigger so for uh, yarn art jeans i used the 2.5 millimeter crochet hook for this two millimeter crochet hook additionally i used a piece of thick felt of four millimeter uh, you see dark gray is uh, under this uh, layer of the um, bottom it's a uh, thick felt and black for wheels i crochet wheels and finally i added a piece of a thick felt i cut it and it's a really nice bottom of, of the car i used a tapestry needle um, needle for felting, scissors, stuffing, and plastic PVC pipe joining this two wheels. Here is the PVC, you see it on the uh, photos and um, I, I cut it a PVC 20 millimeters in diameter. I wrapped the ends of the pipe with electrical tape. I also prepared for you, for you the template for the big lightning numbers and this lettering. If you don't want to needle felt this uh, on the hood, you may uh, cut it and uh, with a piece of felt and glue. Firstly, I crochet this top part starting from uh, the hood red yarn i crocheted 38 rows i worked in rows one turning chain in the end of uh, every row then i changed to white uh, this is sewed uh, eyelid i crocheted a uh, white and then after making the car i sewed this red eyelid so we have 30 eight rows of red then white eight rows and then change to red 20 rows and then change to dark gray 12 rows then uh, red once again eight rows and then i added chains on this uh, sides because i wanted to make this sticking part uh, this uh, I, I crochet this red part then uh, uh, in below uh, inserted the hook and crochet uh, this uh, side and finally i worked uh, slip stitches to uh, make this folding and then i continue with a red yarn so these details uh, i made in the end this uh, mm, uh, slip stitches uh, this details uh, thin stripes with the slip stitches 
when the top part was ready, I um, crocheted these sides. And this is the same pattern for this both sides. Now I tell you about this side. I crocheted them separately and I worked top bottom. Uh, it's a upside down view. Um, everything is explained in the pattern. Uh, there are photos with the markers uh, um, because I had to crochet uh, this uh, wheel arch here and uh, here and I had to adjust it um, to a um, number of stitches of the top. It was really time consuming to work out uh, the idea how to uh, join, how many stitches uh, um, crochet to make this uh, part. Uh, so I started with the chain 67 and inserted the uh, hook in the second chain from hook and worked 66 single crochet. And in row in the third row I divided numbers of stitches for three parts. The first part 24 single crochet, the second part 28 single crochet, it's the middle part, and the back part uh, 14 single crochet. After making the sides, I crocheted additional uh, rows. I show you like this, uh, starting uh, from the marker uh, and crochet. Uh, in the rows like this because I wanted to rise this back you see this is this part and I wanted to prepare um, uh, stitches for um, the uh, window because uh, the first row uh, was crocheted in BLO uh, so I had to make a, a red row firstly to um, then to make this window but I tell you about the window in a moment firstly um, firstly finish this uh, sides so I crochet 42 single crochet from the marker uh, it's in the photo in my blog I rise uh, this back uh, part then I joined the uh, sides this uh, uh, front fender and back fender with uh, this top part. I left this uh, middle part um, for the window firstly. To join the top part and this front and the back I need to um, mark the common points. So I counted 14, uh, 14 rows uh, of this uh, top part, this uh, um, hood and 14 rows of this uh, fender and I uh, joined on the wrong side because you see the seam is not visible because the seam is uh, on the wrong side and so I had to join on the wrong, wrong side with a slip stitches and then I inverted this um, um, on the right uh, side to make the window. As for the windows in dark grey, the first row is crocheted in BLO. Um, uh, so I crochet, crochet in rows, um, and the last row is 17 uh, stitches in the row. So I um, mark the next uh, common point to um, join the top and the window. Uh, 17, uh, 17. Uh, rows on the top of the top and uh, here is 17 uh, stitches so it's a kind of uh, in this uh, point and to join the I didn't tell you about it to join this back fender um, when I crochet this back uh, part uh, there was a three a kind of three stars in the middle uh, is a stir is joined with the half of this dark uh, dark gray uh, window in this point. So 
so markers are really useful uh, they help uh, to join these uh, parts and then um, in the end I crochet this uh, red stripe inserting the hook, hook in the front loop only because uh, I crochet in below the first row of the window and thanks to that I have uh, um, additional loops to make this stripe when the car was ready I sewed this uh, eyelid but uh, firstly I had to crochet the, the eyes because you see this eye is uh, built uh, under this eyelid and then when I sewed the eyes I sewed this um, this uh, part of the eyelid and finally I embroidered this black uh, black edging with the yarn art jeans so we have uh, the um, top of the sides uh, the windows joined and as for joining uh, it's uh, better to join as you uh, look at the front and I joined with the red yarn hooking from this from uh, right to the left here this part also from right to the left and this part um, from right to the left on this uh, on this side when you're looking at the front of this uh, part because you have a nice joining it's quite neat uh, looking from this point then I crocheted a dark grey wheel arches uh, to put the wheels um, um, in this uh, kind of uh, arch so uh, I crocheted grey stripes for front and the back wheels you um, don't see them um, because they are um, inside and then when this uh, wheel arch uh, were ready I joined this wheel arch with uh, with this uh, in arch of the red uh, fenders with a single crochet from this to this part you crochet from right to the left so I crochet uh, and joined from right to the left to get this knit uh, seam then I, I cut a piece of black felt uh, 10 centimeters in diameter um, for uh, the wheels because I crochet the wheels starting from the red yarn then to the black and uh, put a stuffing and finally add this uh, um, this uh, piece of uh, felt because I wanted to make this wheel a nice shape when the wheels were ready I sewed the the wheels to this uh, wheel arches I also wanted to create the shape for the uh, for the car uh, to join these two sides so in this parts uh, I crochet you cannot see because it's uh, inside I crochet 14 chains to join these two sides mm, to shape the car and get the proper size uh, of this pipe between wheels and um, this pipe is also uh, inside um, uh, it is uh, eight centimeters long and I put the pipe of the PVC pipe of two centimeters in diameter and um, I crochet the tube for this pipe to um, make it uh, safe um, and I sewed finally to this uh, wheels in the end I crocheted this grey uh, part grey bottom I also cut a piece of uh, grey felt uh, to put uh, under this uh, crochet bottom to make a nice uh, uh, stiff 
shape. The piece of felt is uh, about uh, 16 centimeters uh, in this uh, wide, wide and uh, 40 centimeters um, long, but you need to adjust to your project because some people are crushing really strictly, some people loosely uh, are crushing, uh, so uh, it depends on the tension of uh, the yarn and the gauge. When the bottom was ready and uh, the piece of felt uh, was uh, cut, and I joined the sides uh, in the red part with the bottom with uh, a red yarn and I crocheted a single crochet um, but uh, you see these black wheels are not joined with a single uh, crochet but I sewed with a grey yarn to this part so I you join with the red uh, yarn with a single crochet only in this uh, from um, right to the left with a wheel arch here you see and in this part it's sewed because it was real difficult to um, crochet uh, in this uh, parts and I was really, really happy because the uh, car was shaped. It was stuffed, of course. Uh, don't forget to stuff be before you close the opening. Uh, I had to leave this one uh, side uh, um, not joint to put the, uh, the, uh, the stuffing. Then only details uh, are left, but the details were really time consuming. So I told you about the red eyelid, the eyes, this stripe, three thin red uh, stripes with slip stitches in the back uh, window. I embroidered black uh, details on the wheels, headlights and tail lights and the lightnings. Here we have a lightning. As I told you, I used Madame Tricot from yellow orange to red. Then I sewed this uh, crochet uh, numbers. Uh, I sewed the numbers, but they need to be um, with this black edging before sewing. I sewed with a black yarn or jeans, uh, two plies. I was exhausted <laughs> after uh, sewing these uh, parts. Then here you see on the roof also sewed with a black yarn and this yellow uh, yellow round and sewed with a yellow yarn here and uh, this lettering is difficult uh, firstly I sketched with a thin yarn and then I used this uh, mm, oh, felting wool yellow and the needle felted this and this little grey lightning, white mouth with Himalaya dolphin baby, everything is explained on the pattern and on the photos I attached in my blog. I think it's um, everything I could tell you about this car. I like it very, very much. I hope you like it too. Thank you very much. Bye!